I want to show you guys a little sneak peek of Game Dev Vlog Episode 4. Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Mike the Maniac, back with another video. This video is going to kind of be like a little update video explaining some content changes I'm going to make, some of the aesthetic changes I made with the channel, and just overall some new stuff. First off, let me introduce myself. I'm Micah, I'm almost 17, and I run this YouTube channel that you should totally subscribe to. First off, we're going to start with the aesthetic changes. Now, for the past two years, I've had the same aesthetic, same profile picture, and same darn channel art. And I decided, hey, I'm gonna kinda revamp my channel. Might as well make some aesthetic changes. Um, I like the new logo, honestly. I also like my new channel art. This was created 100% by me. Very proud of it. And I hope, you know, when, when people now look at the channel, I hope that really catches their eye. Makes them be like, ooh, this guy's professional. Because we all know I'm a 10 out of 10 professional. Next, I would like to talk about some changes I want to make with the channel. Now last year I made a video kind of explaining some stuff I wanted to change up. And I said I don't really want to play some games anymore. I want to focus more on making a game, which I have been doing. But I've noticed that process is kind of slow and I don't get to pump out as many of those videos and uh, it's often months before you see an upload from me. So I would like to announce that gaming content is going to come back. I'm so excited. There's, there's, there's just some things that I really want to play. Uh, you know, maybe do some stuff in Minecraft because Minecraft seems to be popular. Even though I made Minecraft content back when it was considered cringy. And maybe I'll do some sort of reaction videos to like uh, memes, uh, subreddits, and I don't know, just, just anything. Third main point I'd like to mention is what's behind me. Obviously, I, I don't think everyone really wants to see the back of my room, especially with that ugly door that hasn't been stained and uh, sometimes my messy bed. So, I have some plans with my setup. I kind of want to get like a, a green screen or a blue screen back here. Um, just so that way I can just overlay myself over a background. Also, this, this desk right here, it, it kind of gets in the way. Um, I don't think there's some, much I can, I don't think there's much I can do about that unless I like take off this entire portion of the desk uh, but you know if I do get like a green screen or something maybe I'll try moving my webcam around and just try trying something new with the setup just so that my, my videos just look nicer lastly I'd like to talk about my game development series devlog number four is on the way I'm currently making some 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 changes to it uh, I figured if I'm gonna make some changes to these game development videos might as well make some changes to my channel so this next video is gonna be completely different from how all the other ones were made um, I'm pretty excited I'm still adding some features into my game so I don't really expect to release the fourth devlog for a, a little while uh, I guess until I have you know, things kind of flushed out. Um, I'm gonna kind of go into some of the history on, you know, why I chose to develop this game. I'm gonna go into like more detail than I've went into before if I've really gone into it before. And with that, the video is almost over, but I wanna show you guys a little sneak peek of Game Dev Vlog Episode 4. Getting the animations for combat was tricky. I had to take the cursor's location into account and apply animations based on that. The biggest problem was the player's idle state. I added states in the player's code to be referenced and to make things easier. I added a check to make sure the player wasn't attacking and if the player was, then the idle state would wait until it was done. The problem 
problem was. I hope you guys enjoyed that exclusive look at Game Devlog Episode 4. I'm really excited to be making this and I'm I'm just the past few months of development have they've just been really nice. I've I've really enjoyed my time adding new features to the game and just bringing it a few more steps closer to completion. And with that, it is the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'd appreciate it if you left a like or if you didn't like the video, you can leave a dislike. Uh, consider subscribing and maybe ring that bell for uh, Game Devlog Episode 4 if you're excited for that. See you in the next video. Bye bye I hope that was good. I hope that was a good recording.